Jeff Sutters here with Texas Guardian Program and SOT Firearms. Now today we're going to talk about loading a magazine and making your handgun ready to fire. Okay, so we have our magazine. It's full of rounds. Okay, we have our slide locked and open. So now we're going to insert our magazine. So a lot of people will use the uh, slide release on the side at this point to go ahead and load around in the chamber. That is a, a bad idea. That slide release is only for uh, when you're cleaning it or to verify that a firearm is clear. Um, also, if you keep using this to close your slide to load around in the chamber, you're gonna wear down the metal parts. So the proper way to load the handgun at this point, uh, you have a spring in here. So you wanna pull your slide all the way back so it goes back about half an inch and then let it go. Don't follow the slide forward with your hand. You want the full compression of that spring, all the power in that spring to push that bullet up into your breech. So what happens is if you don't do that, a lot of times is you're gonna get a jam or a stove pipe and you're gonna have a, a misfire or malfunction. Okay, so we're gonna do this again. So you have your magazine out, you have your handgun open, the slide locked. So if you're shooting with a fully loaded magazine, uh, your last round has been spent, your slide will automatically uh, lock to the open position. So at this point we can slide in our magazine, pull back to compress it and let it go. And then we have a round in the chamber. This will ensure that your fire will not malfunction, at least on the first shot. But these are all mechanical devices, so they can malfunction at any point in time. So we want to give this handgun every opportunity to do its job. Okay, another thing I want to talk to people about is um, loading your magazine with your ammunition. Now, I mean, I do this so often, I can use my thumb and press it in here and load the, load the round just like that. There are assist little devices you can put over the top if you're shooting a lot you know 100 and several hundred rounds uh, we do this in training all the time we use the little assister to go over this but if you're out in the field um, in a life or death situation uh, hopefully you're carrying two or three magazines but if you have to load a magazine in the field um, you're gonna have to do it by hand with your fingers so i really encourage you to do this as often as you can you'll build up callus you'll be sore for a little while but you know load up your magazine you know, five or six times every week or so until you kind of get that down. So it does take some dexterity and get some getting some used to.